All right, guys, I just finished up the edit on this video and uh, I wanted to jump in real quick and put this before it starts just to put the, the word out there. I am not against any company. I love Evolution Power Sports, what they've done for Brianna's car, what they've done for us. They are awesome people. I really enjoy them, but I'm not going to talk bad about any other company. Everybody's out there doing their thing and, and killing it. So anytime I'm out racing, it's just for fun and I never want anything to come across as being negative against anybody because that's that's not who I am. I just love the industry in general and I want everybody to succeed. So any racing, anytime, anything, all that good stuff, I'm not going to bash on anybody. So there's no reason to do it in the comments. I doubt you will, but online, that's all you see is everybody bashing each other. I'm not about that. So it's just about fun. But anyways, enjoy it. All right, guys, we are back. We're in the sandbox today, which is ironic because the owners of the sandbox are right there. So there's Pete and Lene. Then you guys know Jonathan. You know Nate. I know. Kaylee's here. Hi. You don't know Kaylee yet. Uh, Ren is over there. We put a hole in the airbag line. So the Trails West was on. If there was bump stops, it would have been on bump stops. Like, it was bad. Oh, really? It blew out. It melted a line. So you got a Chevy. So. Oh, I'm joking. Edit that Technically, out it was just the airbags Ren put on yesterday, but... You better edit that out of the video. <laughs> yeah. We were going to plug your show, your channel. Oh, but... <laughs> yeah. So speaking of that, check out this shirt right here. So what you need to do is go to Offroad Diaries website, this guy right here, and get yourself a shirt, because these are awesome. And they're the next level, like the nice okay. shirts. Are they nice? Yeah. I don't know. I just deal with my t-shirt guys. So. Yeah. Yes. No, these are the nice shirts. So go get your one. They're the nice ones. Yeah, as soon as Ren's done there, we've got Pete Lene from the Sandbox, we've got Jonathan. There's a bunch of people already out at Choke from what I've told. So Ooh, we're gonna head out that way and there. yeah, we'll go out through the big stuff and have some fun. Might stop a little bit. This guy wants to do some droning. Please do, I'd love I to hope do that. So. But the the droning is awesome. It's a really killer when I stop, it's a lot easier. In the passenger seat, it's like... <laughs> so what oh. we'll do is I'll just share all the drone footage with you. That way you can have it, because we're both there. Me cortisol. <laughs> See! You wanna drive at points? Sure. Okay. All right. Well, we are headed out. So, tag along. day it's kind of blowing now but you can see how smooth the sand is got a nice line up here more people out of choke stopped with the belt blown so that's fixed and now we're gonna head back out
I'm actually spinning, I don't have to follow her with it. You following Dietrich up? That's Kaylee. Are you following D? Walking up. It's safe to say that Kaylee won. Started doing this thing on my channel where everything is a positive message. I saw that last video, night because I just like I want to inspire people, and I was like, today's positive message is going to be about persevering. You know what I mean? I like it. I do all watch it, watch all Atwood stuff too. He's, See, I like I that guy. Got, yeah, I just got on this weird thing, so. Pass out. I, do. I need to do it for my phone so I can comment because I'm doing it all for my TV so I don't. Well, what I, you do is you connect your phone to the YouTube. And you YouTube. can comment from you. Yes. And then you can no go and just click shit. on video because that's, that's how I reply to any video I watch. Oh, no shit. I need to do that. Positive message. We're still on it. That car's fast. I'm wondering. That's a built motor car. Uh, I felt pretty good across the top. That was, that was nice. I'm going to get my ass at it to me because I know that car, but it's a good shot. I feel like Trevor's going to go in there. Trevor's going to go in uh, uh, Probably up there somewhere. Who knows that drive? Bad for that a, was not bad, not at bad all. for a stock Maverick car. Not too bad for a Maverick tons, car, huh? Tons and tons of bolt ons. Every bolt on you can think of, pretty much. Car that's running can't handle it. Mavar, I've seen lots of X3s go real fast. Oh, yeah, X3s yeah. are fast. That's yeah. probably. Well, these big heavy cars are big heavy cars. Yeah, that one weighs about the same as yours. Yeah. And they're every bit of 2,300 pounds. I like Norm's explanation. He said these big heavy cars are big. They're heavy big cars. heavy cars. <laughs> you can feel it. You yes. get in an X3 and you feel like you're just floating. Yeah, just a little toy. I mean, I'll admit, like, they're right at the probably the last. Third. I would say last third of it is when you can see the pro are kind of just pulling a little bit. I have more. one more tune, but that one's kind of the max tune. That's another about 16 to 20 to the tires, but let's do it. Well, just uh, this weekend. Yeah, do it. I haven't tested that one yet. This is a good to test. my knowledge, I'm running more boost on a boondocker setup than anybody's run yet. Yeah. Now, he'll yeah. be out here tomorrow. Who? Help to him. But Junior? I've, I've done some things that he didn't do. Yeah. Who, Junior's coming out tomorrow? Junior is. Yeah. Yeah. I'm impressed. That was a good run, honestly. This, this is the fastest today, this weekend, is the fastest that car's been. So, She's but, running good. Yeah. And we're not I, sitting at 100 degree temperatures. No, like that. Yeah. A couple yeah. days ago, I was about the to die. The sand was fantastic. Coming. I want to put that tune yeah. on it, but it's like, go do it. Do it. Peer pressure. Do let's, it. let's at least get through tonight because I'm supposed to be riding tomorrow. 
no, 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 Okay. I just thought that would be very ironic if it was. That would be the perfect call. <laughs> How long have you been coming to the dudes for? Since 21. 21. Hey, excuse me, 2001. 2001. So you've got a couple days of duding in your... Just a few. The He's gray been hair. up a, yeah. <laughs> The gray hair is from here. Norm's been up the hill a couple times. Anyway, back in the day, I had a, if you will, player scrambler plastic with a 800 RMK in it with nitrous on it. There's, was it yellow? No, it was black. There's black an, and orange. Isn't there another it's older gentleman? I, I say older, he's in his 80s. Yeah. Who yeah, has one out here? Yeah. But this was back in 2003 and 2004. Radar at the top on video at 78 miles an hour. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if I have 55, I'm like, yes. Is there anybody else in your group that's fast? Is there anybody else in your group that runs good, or are you the fastest one? I'm the fastest one. That's That's a, not working. I'm happy. Now I got beat earlier myth, today. The man, the myth, the legend, know. Mr. Norman. Jared oh, session. Oh, I know Jared. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Well, Jared's cars. Well, it's a stroker. Yeah. With more boost bounce head. Yeah. Way bigger turbo. And more boost. And I think if he wasn't. Ah, uh, we were running the same. the Pete showed me. I saw it all before it ever went out. When I came up there and saw it. Is that a dominator turbo on that? I don't feel like that's a stock. No, it's just a tune. Tune or muffler. That's it. It's it's a stock but engine, stock turbo scared, with like, a well, tune. A <laughs> runs, I run good. It's to be just tuned, man. Yeah, it's bike and <laughs> Is it? I believe, I believe so. Huh. I like Jared a lot too. Yeah, though. Jared's good. He's a good dude. He's got a fast Maverick. I really want him to be out tomorrow. So I, I would play love with to it. see him because he beat everybody's Maverick. I know. That's why I want to play with it. Him. And all he has is a boost controller and an exhaust. I don't even think it's tuned. I don't <laughs> like, believe him. <laughs> that's what he told me when I saw him a few weeks ago. What? <laughs> Somebody saw him go fast stuff with light? Yeah. <laughs> just saying. Uh, yeah, that's, I'll say it. You guys can. That's why I want to race him. I want to just see. I, his car, I think I might message him tonight and be like, hey, let's maybe go Maybe not out. before, but I think now your car is moving. Now, oh, yeah. is this, are y'all, you seeing, uh, where are you staying at? Eagle Lakes. Oh, okay, okay. That's, you know, first off, it's cheaper there. And we always get reservations that are parked out. And we don't like that ride through the rocks all the way out to come out to get sand. Yeah, no. That's, that's the honesty of it. I wish I could find property so I could build an RV park out here. So if you know anybody ever selling any farmland, <laughs> get a hold of paper. All right, it is time to go. So we are packing up. We're going to head back. And then we are coming out in the morning. But uh, we'll talk about that tomorrow. You're doing good at this YouTube business. YouTube? YouTube? YouTube. No more crazy transitions, please. What? No you, more crazy transitions. Do you want to go lower? I don't care. We, we can do highway back. Do crazy transitions. We'll, we'll do lower. Okay. All right, everybody. We are out here. <clears throat> it is now Saturday. We finished up last night. Decided we were just going to do some more filming today. So we're coming out and we're seeing what that will do against anything that will race it. So we got Jared Sessions, got a KT Pro R. Um, I actually already raced them. I just forgot to record an intro. So I got my ass handed to me by that Pro R on 20 pounds. 12 pounds, we were very similar, but you'll see all that. My car runs good. FP green car. So anyways, we're out here having fun again today. It's Pioneer weekend. So a lot of the Utah people are up here. So we are just chilling and seeing how many times I can win or get beat in this Mav R. So. At least get a baseline of where we're at.
Last time I hit those bumps and it bounces rev limiter and it throws it into like a limp mode and it won't shift. Yeah. I finally was just smashing it and it finally went into fourth. But yeah. Like this one is like, you know, it, feel, it pulls really good and then all of a sudden it goes to fifth and then like it shouldn't go to fifth and no. then you pull away pretty good. No, when I, the fastest I've gone is I kind of roll into it and make it, make it stay in third. That's the fastest I've been able to go, but it hits like 85 at the top. Yeah, I mean, this thing I, doesn't have a raised rev limiter. I think yeah. it's like only like, I'm only like 70 something at the top. Really? Yeah. Yeah, so when you do tranny tuning and raise the limiter, it helps because then it stays in third right in power band. I and notice when I go to fourth, it's down to 7,000. Yeah. Which 7,000 from 85, that's a big jump. Like on my speedo, the fastest I've ever come up at is like 59 ish. Yeah. So I, I, last night when I was leaving from the bottom where me, you started, I was doing 62. Yeah. So I've never done a run. I don't know what it'll do there. Let's yeah. roll once and I'm going to try to paddle shift and just keep it from shifting just to see. Yeah, that car runs good. I'm going to put it two-wheel drive. That way it's, uh, I feel like it's faster in two-wheel drive. But whenever you launch in this, it automatically puts it to four. Oh, and you come out hard. Yeah. These paddles come out really good. Yeah. That's why it's like, do I really switch? Because these ones work so I don't well. know. I mean, with, the, with that front combo, obviously I have nothing. Yeah. But you come out hard. I mean, obviously I don't have any console. Yeah. yeah. And you I'm, can't really brake stand them either. Otherwise, I'm going to limp them. I'm only coming out on 48-ish where I can go up to 62. But I think that's a little too much for this Sam. Yeah. I get a launch at like 28. You want to do a roll? Yeah, let's do it for fun. I'll see if I can keep it. on the bumps i lost them. all right another day of riding well, i guess a full another weekend of riding going home calling it for the weekend but overall man i am impressed with that maverick car every time i come out it's just a blast got the wheels up i'm going to get some different tires i think we tried to find some good wheelie hills and our normal wheelie hills that we could usually wheelie pretty easy i just spin like crazy and throw sand 50 feet but uh, I got some new tires I'm going to put on there, throw some 1650s on there, that should really give some good traction, and I really want to wheelie this thing. I mean, you saw in the video, there was one good wheelie, but... You have to set it up perfect. So it's got the power for it, I just am powering through those paddles, I think, but 
Holy crap, that car is awesome. If you guys are on the fence about buying a Maverick car, I can't really say what they do stock because we've never had a stock one, but stage five Evo, all the bolt-ons, I mean, it's just fun. So go get one. But hope you guys liked that uh, vlog. Uh, we had a good time as always. Uh, give us a comment, tell us what you liked, what you didn't like, or what you want to see in future vlogs, and that would be awesome. We'll do our best to accommodate that. But again, till the next one, see ya.